Hello everyone, I'm Emily. Today I'm going to show you how to make my favorite sweet and sour pork bowl. This is the recipe from my father-in-law and it's something that we order every time we're back home. To make the meatballs, these are the ingredients. This is pork shoulders, which has the perfect balance of fat and meat. Other ingredients include the white pepper, minced garlic, chicken powder, sesame oil, corn flour and a piece of tofu. To make the sweet and sour sauce, we need a pineapple, tomato sauce, broccoli, water, dark vinegar, sugar, capsicum, and onions. I prefer to hand grind the meat myself. First, using a sharp knife or cleaver, slice the pork and cut it into small cubes. Then, rapidly chop the meat. Split and fold the meat over and continue to chop from one side to the other until the meat reaches the desired fineness. After that, we are going to combine the pork mince with all the other ingredients that we prepared earlier. Massage the mixture until well combined. The purpose of adding the tofu is to cut down the fat in the meatball and make it tender. But remember to squeeze out the extra water by using a paper towel, otherwise the meatball will be soggy. Oops, I forgot to add the soy sauce. Please remember to add 1 tablespoon of soy sauce to increase the saltiness. Preheat the oil. Once it reaches 180 degrees Celsius, lower down the heat. Roll a tablespoonful of the mixture into bowls. Slowly and carefully put the mixture into the oil. Do it in two to three batches and dish out when it turns golden brown. Then we move on to do the sweet and sour sauce. You can use a fresh pineapple or if you think it is too much work, you can use a canned pineapple. Remove the eyes, cut the pineapple into half and remove the core. Sweet from tomato sauce and sour from vinegar. This is the formula for sweet and sour sauce. Simple and easy. We don't want complexity. Adding 1 teaspoon of salt and broccoli into the boiling water and this will be the side dish and also for decorating purpose. To start cooking our sweet and sour sauce, first we have to fry the onion until it is fragrant. Then add the tomato sauce that we prepared earlier and we have to add some vinegars for the sourness, the capsicums and also the pineapples and give it a quick toast. Finally add the pork bowl back to the sauce. Toast around and ensure each bowl are coated with sweet and sour sauce. For plating, arrange the broccoli around the plate, place the sweet and sour pork in the middle, and that's it! I'm sure you will be very proud when you serve this dish on the table for your guests. If this is your must-order menu every time you go to the restaurant, why don't give it a go and make it at home? I hope you enjoyed today and we'll see you again next week. Bye!